The Carboniferous period spanned from about 359 to 299 million years ago. This era is divided into two subperiods, the Mississippian and the Pennsylvanian. It was a time of lush vegetation, vast swampy forests, and a climate that would seem almost alien to us today. The Earth's atmosphere was markedly different, playing a crucial role in the development of its unique ecosystems. One of the most striking features of the Carboniferous period was its high oxygen levels. The atmosphere contained about 35% oxygen, compared to the 21% we have today. This elevated oxygen concentration is believed to have allowed insects and other arthropods to grow to enormous sizes. Among these giants were dragonflies with wingspans of up to 28 inches and millipedes that stretched over 6 feet long. Imagine walking through a forest and encountering such colossal creatures. But why exactly did insects grow so large during this period? The answer lies in their respiratory systems. Insects breathe through a network of tubes called trachea, which deliver oxygen directly to their tissues. Higher oxygen levels meant that oxygen could diffuse more efficiently throughout their bodies, supporting larger sizes. However, as the oxygen levels eventually decreased, these giant insects couldn't sustain their massive bodies and gradually diminished in size. The Carboniferous period was also marked by extensive swampy forests dominated by lycophytes, horsetails, ferns, and the first true trees, such as Archaeopteris. These dense forests not only provided habitat for giant insects, but also contributed to the formation of vast coal deposits. The dead plant material accumulated in these swamps and over millions of years was compressed into coal. This is why the Carboniferous is sometimes referred to as the Coal Age. In these lush forests, life thrived both on land and in the water. The swamps were home to an array of amphibians, which were the dominant vertebrates of the time. Early amphibians, like the labyrinthodonts, ranged from small, salamander-like creatures to large, crocodile-sized predators. These amphibians laid the groundwork for the evolution of reptiles, which would eventually dominate the land. The Carboniferous seas were equally rich in life. Coral reefs flourished, providing habitat for a variety of marine organisms. Brachiopods, crinoids, and trilobites were abundant, while early sharks and bony fish patrolled the waters. The reefs and shallow seas were teeming with life, creating a vibrant underwater ecosystem. The climate during the Carboniferous period was warm and humid, particularly in the equatorial regions where the vast coal swamps were located. The extensive forests played a significant role in the global carbon cycle, as they absorbed large amounts of carbon dioxide and released oxygen. This contributed to the high oxygen levels and may have helped to stabilize the climate for millions of years. However, the Carboniferous period wasn't without its challenges. Towards the end of this era, the climate began to change. The Earth experienced a glaciation event, leading to a cooler and drier climate. The extensive coal forests started to decline, and with them, the giant insects that had thrived in the oxygen-rich atmosphere. This climatic shift set the stage for the Permian period, which followed the Carboniferous. One fascinating aspect of the Carboniferous period is its legacy. The coal deposits formed during this time have had a profound impact on human history. Coal powered the Industrial Revolution, driving technological advancement and shaping the modern world. It's intriguing to think that the lush forests and swamps of the Carboniferous period laid the foundation for our current energy resources. As we explore the age of giant insects, it's important to appreciate the intricate connections between Earth's atmosphere, climate, and life. The Carboniferous period was a time of extraordinary biodiversity and environmental change, highlighting the dynamic nature of our planet. So, what was Earth like in the age of giant insects? It was a world of towering trees and vast swamps, where dragonflies the size of seagulls and millipedes as long as cars roamed the land. It was a time when amphibians thrived in the steamy forests, and the seas were alive with diverse marine life. This era, with its unique atmospheric conditions and ecosystems, offers us a glimpse into the incredible adaptability and resilience of life on Earth. Thank you for joining us on this journey back in time. If you enjoyed this video and want to learn more about Earth's fascinating history, make sure to like, comment, and subscribe. Until next time, stay curious and keep exploring the wonders of our world.